they say they want it out and down now uh, we don't have any kind of ladder or anything out here tall enough for me to reach it so what I think I'm gonna do is probably take that whole limb down I think I'm just gonna climb up there and saw that whole fucking limb down wish there was some way I could get right up in here and chop it off there but I don't know we'll see so I've taken a broom handle and I've duct taped this saw to it and I'm gonna go over there I'm gonna saw that limb down so let me try to figure out how to get this positioned decently so that you get to see all that <laughs> and man uh, yeah Okay. okay, so I've got the camera sitting inside of a bird bath. And I think that'll hold. There we go. So we're just going to get up there and try to saw that limb down. Let's see. Might have to pull it back a little so you can see the folly of, of my ways here. There we go. So now you can see the folly of my ways. Let's go see if we can do this. Ooh. So, right inside the bird bath, there's a little piece of bone. It's been all chewed up and gnarled. Hm. All right, let's go do it. Again, as I said before, I really don't want to kill them. I just want them to leave. But I'm going to have to spray this wasp and hornet stuff at them to get them out of there so that I can cut it down safely. Definitely not happy about it. And again, I may have to take that limb down further back. I think that's what I'm going to have to do. All right, so I'm just going to try to take it down a little further back. I think I picked a, a very poor saw to use. Is this not doing too well on that branch? We'll keep at it though. I've got to get it down. Yeah, unfortunately, this is the only saw they have. So I've got a hoe, and I'm going to try to reach up there and pull down on the branch and maybe get closer to something I can cut. Okay, so there's a, there's a start to an idea. So what I think I'm going to do is tie a heavy rock to that and then uh, put it back up there and that will help pull the branch down. Alright, so I have uh, some cordage I found in the shed in there uh, attached to these three bricks and I'm going to go attach that to the hoe which is going to pull the limb down I think.
Well, it worked. <laughs> so I definitely lowered it. Kind of angered the wasps a bit, but eh, it did lower it. So now it's going to be easier to to cut. Of course, this is not the perfect way to do this. I don't have the equipment to really get in there and do it safely and properly. But when do I ever, right? There we go. I use what I have, when I have it, how I have it, and the way I can do it. So. There we go. So let's go back in there and try to get that cut down before I get stung to death. Hopefully you get a pretty decent view. I know it's pretty far away. Hold on. Yeah, there we go. There you go. So here we go. Let's go do it. Nope. Uh, sawing that branch off is going to be a pain in the ass and not possible with all those wasps running around. I need a, something to clip them off with, but I don't have the large clippers. So there is nothing. I'm going to just have to buckle down, get in there, and saw the limb off somehow with this further back. I've got a wooden bench sitting out there and uh, that's the best I'm going to do. I might as well just get out there and get it to going. Yep. Here we go. Okay, I went digging around and I did find these. Now it's definitely not gonna get me far enough away. So, I'm gonna have two sticks and I'm gonna duct tape these handles onto two sticks and we'll see if this will work.
One more time. Well, I'm getting there. Just cutting it. Just doesn't want to fall. I tore a piece of it. That sucks. I may have to leave it up there long enough to let them fix it. I think I tore part of the side. But it is working. So I'm going to tape this back up a tad bit. like that. Take this side up a tad bit. Tighten it up a little. All right. Now, let's go take a look. I think I caused some damage to it. And I'm not really happy about that. <sighs> I used the video camera to kind of look. Oh shit, yeah, I tore a big thing on the side there. Yeah. Oops. Now I'm thinking that I should leave this for a little bit, but I can't now because I've already got it cut. The wind blows that thing, and I gotta take it down. Crap. All right. So, I, I, as like I said, I'm unhappy that I actually broke it, but Recording. All right. Yep. All right. One more. One more again. It's not going to work. No, well. Oh, that makes a whole lot of sense. Whoa. Okay. So, you've got bricks attached to the end of a, a hoe. Pardon my French. And we got, we got skizzers. All right. You ready for this? I've been recording the whole time. All right, don't stop recording if I start getting stung no, really bad. You know for a fact I ain't gonna stop. Oh, that, oh no, come on, don't destroy it. Oh, you're destroying it. Ah, oh, son of a bitch. No. Oh, it's, it's done for. No, it ain't. It's, it's good. done for. Okay. Yeah, definitely put it up there at the base. Here. I'm gonna get it up in here. Twist it. There we go. Okay. You really know how to work a hoe. Yeah, I, yeah exactly. 
Oh, there's one flying around. Yeah, I thought about leaving it for a week or so and let let him fix it. Grandma have shit fit. Can't but, do that. Yeah. Oh, there's a few of them flying around. Yeah. This is a horrible Ooh, that's idea. That's a big one. Yeah, fuck this. Yes, yes, I want this that bad. You are willing to be stung by, I've seen five in total. Yes. Okay, go. Okay. Oh. Dude, he almost got me. So, accomplished, you know, I did a little damage to it and I'm upset about that, but I do have it out of the tree. So now we're going to set it somewhere where it'll be safe and not attract more wasps and then they can go about their business and get out of here. Okay, so there's still... Some of these hornets still around, but I'm gonna gonna put it inside this trash can. I hope. See, there's still still some in there moving around. There. And hopefully that will keep it from being reoccupied. And there we go. Just going to let it sit there. And hopefully it doesn't get all wet and it doesn't get destroyed any more than it already is. And I can come back in a week or so and it will be cleared of, of all the hornets. And then I can, uh, I can hang it up and do with as I want. So I rid the property of the hornets and I got a hornet's nest or wasp's nest uh, to boot so so here's the water bath the bird bath that uh, I had the camera sitting in and you can see this bone sitting right here and Jaden pointed out because I didn't even notice it Jaden pointed out right there is a bird skull pretty flimsy and it definitely definitely has been there a while you can see right there see it's been there a while so 